Hello everybody, and welcome. I'm Count Christo, and this is Dome Keeper. I was kindly given a key for this by the developers, and uh, I'm going to release this video on the review embargo, so I'm allowed to make comments about how much I like the game. So, this is my little impressions of Dome Keeper. It's a simple little game, best played with a controller, and uh, it reminds me a little bit of a few games. Number one, um, Motherload. You're old enough to remember Motherload? That was a good game. <laughs> uh, from back in the day, you basically mine down and gather resources and get upgrades to gather resources faster in this game. But the twist is, you also have to defend your dome from horrifying dark creatures from beyond the void. And uh, I have played one game. I've won my first, my first game. Uh, and we're going to try another one here today. I don't know if we'll do a full run. We'll see. Uh, but just, you know, spoilers ahead, obviously, because I'm a little bit into the game. So it's a relic hunt. We need to dig down and try and find this this relic-y thing that you see on the right. Uh, we have a laser dome rather than a sword dome, because I haven't unlocked it. Relic hunt. I've unlocked a new gadget, which we're going to try out, which is a repellent. You have waves of enemies, but we'll see how that works in a minute. We've unlocked medium... Uh, you, the first game you play is on small. We've unlocked medium, so we'll play medium. I'm also going to play hard... Um, brutal is what it calls the intended difficulty, but I found normal pretty hard, so we're gonna play normal. And uh, yeah, I'll talk you through the uh, the cycle of the game. There's a link to the Steam for the game in the comments and description of this video, by the way. So if you're interested, do uh, do give that a look. So here we are, landing on a hostile, hostile alien planet, and we can begin our hunt for a relic. It's a cool little intro. I guess maybe the attacks that come in the future are all revenge for that little dude that we just squished. But yeah, here we are. And uh, an enemy attack is coming. So we better get get mining. This is what we're looking for, these little cubes. I think we can carry... Yes, yeah, so the more of them we carry, the slower we go. But I think if I carry four up, that's enough. And we, we carry them up here and they get processed. And then we can sit here and buy upgrades. I think we want the hostile proximity meter and the stored resources counter. Because now you can see in the bottom left, we can see how long until the next uh, next enemy wave, which is good. As you go further down, you can, you'll see that it takes like so. This this type of rock takes significantly more hits to mine. So we probably want to kind of start higher. But this is a lot of resources, so. I think we're going to grab three, because we can move a bit faster with three. You can drop them when you're already carrying them. But yeah, ideally we'd like to... And as you can see, the time between the waves is pretty short. Um, so, alright, we grabbed four there. I think we just want three. We're going to try and get all of these resources back up before the first wave comes, and then I'll show you how the, uh, how the defense system works. We're going to cut it a little bit fine by grabbing these last two. <laughs> Excuse me, but then we're probably gonna go out um, sideways a bit higher up in the next next wave. So we'll drop these two off, then we'll sit down here in time to battle. And then when it's wave time, we play this kind of little game with a laser. We've gotta shoot these dudes before they come and destroy our dome. Very small waves to start with, just the one dude there. Actually, let's, uh, let's buy another upgrade. So as you can see, there's a pretty serious tech tree going on here. <laughs> And we have the delay. Oh, these are different. Right, because this is the repellent. Last time I was playing with a shield, which is like a regenerating, um, you know, shield on top of your health. Um, I think we want to grab... I quite like grabbing speed and drilling speed, so we can move faster and drill faster right out of the gate. Obviously, it has all of the usual things you'd expect, you know. You can drill quite a lot faster which means we can find more resources, which means we can, you know, get more upgrades so we can drill faster and all that stuff. And it scales up the game pretty quickly, I've found. Um, there's not like a lot of downtime at the beginning of the run. Here I can check actually, my first run, on that was on a small map, bear in mind, was about, oh, we found some blue stuff, was um, about 40 minutes long. And there's different, yeah, there's, as you can see, there's three different upgrade materials that you can find. Let's use our, yeah, your repellent is ready to re delay the next wave. Choose A to activate. 
when close to it. Okay, so let's let's head back up and then use the repellent and see how much it delays the next wave by. Okay, so it starts a second meter. It's like the repellent meter, okay. Later we get a scanner, which will assist us in finding stuff. Um and being able to get all the, the resources we need. I don't know how often we're going to be able to use the repellent. I don't know if it's like once a wave or once every few waves. I imagine that's something that we can upgrade to. Hop back into the battle seats just in time for this wave. Shoot this guy down. It takes a long time for the laser to switch over to the other side. So you sometimes have to make tactical decisions about shooting people. Oh, so this guy is probably going to get hit in here. Yeah, one hit on us. We don't have the upgrade that lets us see... Um, how damaged our uh, our thing is yet? Oh, these are good. These red ones are the ones you use to upgrade, like your your defenses, basically. So that'll be that'll be helpful for us. Uh, all right, upgrades. Um, we don't need to repair yet, and you can do this one I'll repeat. You see, it's got the little arrows around it. That means you can do that upgrade multiple times. Um, yeah, displaying the dome's structural health. I don't think we need that yet, honestly. So it should be good. I think, what should we upgrade? I'm feeling fairly secure right now. So let's grab more carry capacity. Because that feels like the, the kind of longer term play. You know, the investment play. I'm trying to dig. We don't have any ability to, to scan for resources yet. So I'm trying to dig such that we're not missing slots. Hey, nice. Grab another one of those. All right, it's getting harder to dig over here. I think we should probably go further up. That's the edge right there, and you can see that it runs out of texture. I think we're going to try and go maybe we'll cut through here, see if there's anything in the middle here. Resources, as you can see, are not hugely common. So you often... Uh, <clears throat> yeah, before we can find the scanner, I'm feeling a little... A little resource starved. Chop this off. Let's see how this fight goes. I'm concerned. We're on the higher difficulty. I feel like I'm going to get roasted. These things, if you're shooting them, they don't. But if you're not... Oh, this isn't good. If you're not sh actively shooting them, they can attack. Oh, this second one's going to hit us a bunch of times. Oh, no, I'm shooting the wrong one. I switched target by mistake. Yeah, so as you can see, we got those little nice little crack graphics on that and I really like the um, the kind of pixel art style of this game it's, uh, it's I don't know it's, it's pleasing I enjoy it everyone has different different feelings about pixel art but I'm just gonna keep going down until we get to there we go the next hardness level and we're gonna have to keep this kind of full-on strip mining going if I don't want to miss any uh, any resources potentially there's some. Grab them on the way back. Ooh, it gets quite a bit wider here. <clears throat> this is a bigger map than the uh, previous one I've played on, so... But yeah, if we're going full strip mine, I guess here's the next spot. I guess the alternative to doing full strip mine, if we think we're still going to get the scanner, because, I mean, I don't know. Maybe getting the scanner was, like, super lucky in my last campaign. We upgraded, so our carry capacity, so I think we can take five at once now. We are looking like we're getting a little bit close to the next wave. I think I'll probably not hit the... Uh, let's hit some upgrades real quick. I think we want love some more attack abilities. Like maybe... What's this? Repellent production speed goes up. 4.5 cycles. That doesn't seem that good. I kind of want it to be... Like four 1.5 cycles per watt. Like once ever? That seems really weak. But is there anything else I need to buy? Counter to show the number of waves? That doesn't seem that useful. Um, I guess we'll get this and just see see what it does. But, oh yeah, battle time. Okay, bring it around. I think we're okay on health for a while, but we will get the counter so that we can determine... Oh, we're going to take a bunch of hits here. We need to upgrade our strength. Which basically means I need a bunch more yellow, whatever it is, gold, in order to uh, get the kind of weapon strength upgrades. 
God, we're taking so many hits. I think they hit faster and faster once they've started hitting. I could be wrong, but... Yeah, we know that we've got that yellow down here that we didn't manage to pick up. Yeah, so we can grab all this. That'll be pretty good. So I want to grab all five. Oh, yeah, and you, you do have to kind of like navigate them around sometimes a bit. So they don't get stuck. Do I want to drag all six off at once? I think I do. And we're going to hit the repellent on this one so we can uh, keep digging a bit longer. We'll also see if we can work out how this repellent boost thing works. I hit A on it, don't I? Yeah. Okay, so that's running. Gives us a bit of extra time to uh, go on a scavenge. I like the um, the pace of this game is good. Like the waves, they come thick and fast. There's not that much downtime. You're not you're not going on like really long digging expeditions. All right, another another five. Sorry, six. That'll be good. I think we'll be able to get back up in time, and then we can use these to do an upgrade that we can have online by the time we have this fight. But yeah, the, the pace of the the combat is good. You don't have to. Um, there's not super long long bits of downtime. It's pretty frenetic. I like it. All right, so we'll get in here, and yeah, we're gonna grab some weapon upgrades. So just straight up. So we can we can we can get an aimer, which shows us where the gun's going. We can get more speed, and we can get more damage. So we can afford both speed and damage. I am gonna grab both of those, and then this next damage one is gonna be good too. Now, so we can go up to this thing. Is that the overdrive on the production speed that I've just activated, do you think? Or is that it just saying you can't do it yet? Oh, yeah. Need to get shots on these guys as soon as possible to stop them lobbing down their missiles. And with the better guns, we should be able to, uh, yeah, take these guys out pretty nicely. Good. Okay, back down we go. Having not found a... I think it's called a module... Which is the thing that lets you get um, more abilities, like a scanner. Ah, here we go. I think that's what this is. Yeah, 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 yeah. So when you spot those those kind of colored lines, we can get one of these things. And this is a module. And now with this, we can get some extra uh, extra upgrades. And let's see, maybe we don't want a scanner. I mean, the strip mine is, is going okay. Maybe I'd like to try out one of the other modules this time around. Okay. Oh, we don't have the option. We've got a resource converter. Can convert resources helping you balance your inventory. Drillbutt, a lovable creature that loves to dig. Carry it into the mine and drop it off where you want it to work. Check back later or when it goes to sleep on the job. Or shred it into cobalt. I think cobalt is the blue one. Drillbutt, of course. We will we'll try him out. Hey, Drillbutt. How's it going? Okay, and then we drop him off down the bottom of the mine. And he can he can dig away right down here. Oh, he's so cute. <laughs> we'll drop him off down there while we mine uh, higher up. We need to start going up soon, and then we'll we'll do a delay at the beginning of the next mining cycle. Not finding much. I need to go back up. I think I actually went up a bit late. So he's digging away down there. Damn yeah, we're going to be late for this combat. That's not good. Oh, crap. Yeah, we're already getting shot at. Oh, yeah, and here's another enemy. These little dudes. No, it's going to shoot us again. Okay, at least we got him there. I think we're going to have to let this these ones on the right hammer on us for a while. We really need the health indicator. Oh, crap. We're taking so much damage. Harder is way harder. I know that's not very surprising, but... Okay. Uh, and yeah, fire off the repellent. Give us a bit of extra time. But yeah, we've taken so much damage already. How's it going downhill, Drillbert? You found anything? Nothing yet. Ooh, hello. Ooh, he's found a, another module slot, I think. Okay, well, we've got time to take these five up and come back down and investigate that, I think. Hopefully, anyway. Still don't really know how the overdrive production thing works. But, yeah, we'll throw these in. Like, I mean, if I go over to it and hit A, I'm guessing that is the overdrive production. It looks like it's an overdrive. You know, sparking line, sparking um, stuff tends to indicate it. I think we're going to investigate what, what Drillbit's found next time. 
I think I need to take these on this slot this time. Can I carry six at once? I think we established six is not too, too slow. I'm sure there's a, you know, a maximally efficient number to be carrying at any particular carry capacity upgrade, but obviously I don't know what that is yet. I think that was the overdrive production because it seems to be producing it fast this time. I think we might, we might have time to do a tiny bit more digging. Let's do, yeah, let's just grab like a couple of, oh, that one can't be done. Yeah, let's just, just do a tiny bit more opening up avenues before we have to go back. You want to be making, you know, most efficient use of your time because you do feel short on time. I should have gone back sooner than this though. We're going to ram some upgrades in real quick before we before we fight here. Yeah, we need to show the health meter. Oh god, we're already at half health. Um, you want to upgrade health later, I think. Especially because it does a percentage of HP. So if we increase the HP, then it's doing more. But let's get melee damage reduction going. And we need one more red for uh, more melee damage reduction. What have I got? Um... All right, debilitate. Spray a numbing mist that slows all monsters down. It lasts for eight seconds. And delay the next wave of monsters by an extra 0.3 cycles. That's pretty good. I think we want the debilitate one. What was this? Last another 25 seconds. We're going to take this. And, ooh, we can upgrade Drillbert. Cool. Uh, let's give him... Okay, he go work for much longer without going sleepy. So he drills for. So this increases the length of time before we have to visit him by fifty percent. I think more drill strength is more relevant. Okay, now let's do battle here. And I don't want to take any damage here, so I've hit the debilitate. Oh, it didn't seem to do anything. The debilitate didn't slow him down at all. Oh god, we're going to get so many hits here. Ah. Uh, no! Shoot down the little guys. No, this big guy's going to let a bunch of the big ones get in. Maybe the debilitate wasn't charged. Oh, we're taking so many hits. Get him, get him, get him. I don't think there's a, a concept of, like, headshots. Um, oops, so we don't need to worry about that. Fire off the... Oh, I can't overcharge it, at least. I guess we'll come back up and fire it halfway through this wave. Let's go check on Drill, but he might be... He did find that new module for us after all. He's still digging away over there. The the sound design is really nice in this game. It's very it's very simple, but it's just pleasing. Hey Drillbert, can I wake you up like halfway through? Like if I grab you and release you. Oh I made him change direction. Alright, grab all this. Oh that's not what I meant to do. Oh and I've dropped the module. No, it's all falling apart. Grab the module. That's fine. He can he can drill down a bit lower. He is cute. <laughs> like a little velociraptor with a drill for a face. Alright, we're going back up. Hopefully this maybe this will give us the scanner. Could be useful. Might might still just not get the scanner. Um since you know it opens up new opportunities, new possibilities. God, we're so damaged. Okay, we've got a lift. Bringing up, re automatically bringing stuff up seems pretty good. And then probe is the scanner. I'm going to go with the lift this time, just to be a bit different. And then we urgently need to uh, to repair, unfortunately. I'd rather not be spending it on repairs, but there's nothing you can get for red and blue, I'm pretty sure. Yeah. So it's time to, uh, oh, here's the lift. Interesting. Time to, uh, time to do battle. I like centering the gun at the start of the fight, just to... Be in the best position to react and if we can ah, still got one shot off if we can keep them at only one shot off though i really don't find the aiming laser that necessary we uh so far i haven't had much trouble knowing where they're going to come knowing where we're going to shoot of course then i'd say that and miss immediately fire off the delayer so there's the lift so what we want now is just yeah, it's going to help us stay down here longer, rather than having to take the long the drive up, which is good. Wonder if Drillbert's asleep yet. I could probably know like how long 200 Drillbert hits tends to be, and then we know like how often we have to go and check in on him. But obviously, having just started playing this game, I I certainly don't. 
he's drilling away down there. I can see the I can still see the stuff moving. I feel like the scanner is kind of essential. But I mean, we've made our bed now, gotta lie on it. It makes carrying capacity way less important, having the uh the lift, I feel like. So do I just carry it here and then drop it? Does that now slowly like float up? How does that work? Maybe it gets carried up on the next uh, thing, or do I have to activate it? Hmm. It doesn't seem to be being carried up, does it? Ooh, Drillbert found some stuff, though. We're running to oh, he's, what's, he's asleep. No, Drillbert, wake up. Okay, good. He's back up it. Back at it. Oh, no, he's fell asleep because he's at the end of a passageway. Oh, I'm going to miss the start of this fight. I think we might die here. Oh, okay, it's grabbing them. Well, I've got to drop them all in it. Oh, crap. Is it helping me fly up faster? I feel like it might be. I feel like this lift is not nearly as good as I was hoping. I was hoping for it to, like, carry them up instantly. Oh, we're going to die. We're going to die. No. Well, yeah, hard is harder. So later gadget to keep for your next run. Ooh. We gotta try more with the lift. <laughs> That's cool, being able to keep a gadget. That's a nice difficulty slider setting. I really like games where they don't just have difficulty settings, they also have like adaptive difficulty. Okay, we're still yeah, we haven't unlocked prestige mode. Or the sword. I feel like repellent was less good than shield. Because shield basically lets you make lots of little mistakes without them accumulating. But, yeah. I Let's give it one more go. <clears throat> Hard, medium, rock and roll. We'll skip the uh, intro this time. Oh, and the, the, my, the, the lift is already in place. Okay, straight at it. No delays. Nice, we can get some... Oh, well, let's jump him here and see how this lift works. So it holds them in place first off. I mean, that's useful on its own. And we're going to have to strip mine if we're going for no no scanner build. Okay, that was far enough down. So I guess that little orb, like they go down to the bottom and then they restart from the top. <clears throat> My only guess. I don't know when the first attack wave is going to start. Like, maybe the music will indicate to us when it's all kicking off. Hey, here's some yellows. Is it just me, or are they a different color this time? I feel like everything's a bit less orange. Maybe it's because we have the shield this time. All right, let's grab the uh, the timer. <laughs> and sure, show me the structural health. All right, we've got a minute yet. Okay, so it grabs them. Oh, once it's grabbed them, it carries them at a pretty decent speed. That's respectable speed. Okay, we want to be making sure that we're always always revealing the maximum number of slots here. Okay, grab these three, because the enemy's coming. On the first wave, though, they're just the walkers, so... Mmm, the lift stops during waves. That's interesting. I am going to carry these. Oh, jeez, he's already here? That's a new enemy. Oh, wait, we're in a new place, I just realized. Damn. Well, he got us pretty good. Hang on. Sorry, just had to pause. Bit of a sneeze there. Uh, okay, so we've got... We need to know We need to know how many resources we have. It's just a, it's an imperative, I think. And now we've got one thing. Yeah, so we can upgrade the shield such that it holds more... I still don't understand the overcharge system very much. Maybe we'll go with... Yeah, Electro Blast is nice. It disables people in melee range temporarily. I'm going to go over here. I know we've got those ones on the right, but they're a long way away just now. Okay. No, grab three. Ah, well, I could have grabbed three on the next one. I guess actually we'll just dump these here. Ah, there we go. And then grab these two. Dump them here as well. And then hopefully they'll be up by the time we uh, we come back from grabbing this one. God, that's a long, long dig, that one. Okay, there we go. He's grabbing them. And how many can the lift grab at once? Three, looks like. Okay. So maybe I'll grab 
Well, actually, no, I'd, I'd rather... I'd rather dig for as long as possible. We need to upgrade the lift, I think. The lift is, right now, is not really... It's not enough to replace me doing it, which is its only function. So, let's grab a couple of these at the top, take them up with us. We could even get the first weapon upgrade right away, if we wanted to. Hmm. I think, uh... Mm, yeah, drill. Drill activity is probably better. Here they come again. Oh, they're little doggy things. Jeez, they're creepy. Alright, tune down. And then the head slam. Yeah, we need to upgrade our, uh, our weapons. But as you can see there, we took two hits, right? But they only hit the shield. Which is nice. So that's, you know, effectively no damage. As long as the shield can regenerate 100% between each wave, which I'm not convinced it can. It might be able to, I just don't know. Hey, nice. Grab another bunch of these. Four is a bit much to carry. We still do need the capacity upgrades. Now that I know that the lift is not just the, the solution that it could be. Let's drop them all there. Go down another level. And we should be trying to focus on digging only in the, uh, the easy digs. As much as we can to start with here. Oh, five is five is too many to carry. Okay, dump these. See if we can grab these ones. Grab more, yeah. Grab these before the next wave if we can. And then let's just take two of them up, because two I can carry at a nice pace. There we go, just in time. And we need we need some weapon upgrades, I think. Yeah, let's grab that. Okay. Oh, no. Flying guys still. Thought it might just be dogs this round, but... Got them. Got them. That's it this round. Okay. Again, mostly just taken on the shield, so... Not too much of a problem. I want to make sure we're unveiling everything with our strip mine here. I don't know if you can infer anything from the background, like there's that, there's orbs and things, can I, are they useful intel? Finally found some blue things, they are a different colour, I swear. Maybe it's just that this, uh, this map has like a different palette. Ooh, what's this? Another, uh, whatchamacallit, gadget, nice. Well, we'll definitely take that straight up. I'm tempted to grab this scanner, honestly. And the gadgets, as you're probably seeing, they're a bit heavier than regular uh, items. Hey, nice, that's convenient, though. <laughs> can drag him all the way up. Okay, we can get Drillbutt, resource converter. I like, I like Drillbutt. Is, he is indeed lovable, so let's grab him. And then upgrades-wise, I need more speed and more carry capacity. All right, come on, Drillbutt. Let's have you down here. And I'll put you here. Digging that way. Good. He's asleep already? What? Oh, because it's a damn it's a wave. No, no. At least the shield will hold them off for a second for us. Quick. Okay, that's good actually. The fact that it was these guys means that we didn't actually miss anything. Uh that second one's gonna get some hits in though. God, the crack the crack animations on the thing are really they're troubling. <laughs> I like it. All right, yeah, into harder drilling here, but not full on hard. Nice. Ooh, nice mother load. Whoa, even better. Okay, let's drag. Let's drag four of them over. Damn, just missed the lift that time. Dump them in. Grab these guys. Excuse me. Grab them. There we go. Not totally mastered the controls yet. Dump them in. Grab him. Dump him in. Let's go and help drill the out heading right. Cool. You know what else this game kind of reminds me of? I think it's just the art style. I can't actually remember the name of the game I'm trying to reference, which is not, not the best. He's asleep again. Let's grab these two, take him up. 
approaching combat. We'll have to wake him up at the beginning of the next cycle. It's not like he'd be awake overnight anyway. Oh, nice. Managed to... Yeah, if you could perfect your control of the physics such that you could always have that work. We need a weapon upgrade. Let's get, uh, yeah, speed. Jeez, the dogs are so fast. But with the weapon damage upgrade, we're doing pretty well. Ah, I should have stayed to kill that dog. And I think I'm going to kill this guy next before we go for the dog. Ah. Uh, they're through the shields. Taking proper damage now. Get him, get him, get him. Okay. Straight back down. Bunch here to be picked up by the lift. We need to upgrade the lift. I know I said that before. Oh, damn, yeah, I've got to wake up Drillbert as well. Drillbert. Back to work. Oh, he's already back to work. Huh. That's curious. Why was he asleep then? Because the wave hadn't started. Interesting. Still figuring the mechanics out. I'm not convinced Drillbert is, is hugely valuable. Maybe once we upgrade him, he becomes like really good. But right now, I think I'd much rather have a scanner. Because you can see how infrequent the resources are when you can just beeline towards them. It does confer a pretty massive advantage. Oh, he's found something for us. We'll head up to it then. Oh, more than more than one. <laughs> Sorry, Joel, but let me grab those. I think he's now going to fall asleep because he's facing the wrong way. Yeah. yeah. Okay, so we'll drop these off and then we'll we'll come down and turn him around at the beginning of the next cycle, I guess. I think I need to leave one behind for the elevator so that we can get up in time for this combat. But I'd like these four because that lets me get a, uh, another upgrade before we go back down. Um, oh no, it doesn't quite, damn. Unless I want the laser aim, but I don't think I do. I think we have more shield HP. What's the default HP? 30? Oh, that's a big increase. Yeah, give me a, give me a substantial shield size upgrade. Come on, get him. Good. You want to stop shooting when you move because you move faster when you're not shooting, I believe. And then he's going to... Yeah, third one. Nothing I can do about that. I can't shoot down shots. I believe there's an upgrade that lets you do that later. All right, step one. Wake drill bit. Or we'll redirect drill bit. Who's down here? Can we make him dig down? I don't think we can. Wake up and then, all right, wake up and then grab. Ah, how do I do that? There we go. have to hold A. And we'll pull him over here. If I'm facing this way, surely he'll go this way. Yeah, there we go. You dig there. Nice. Good little load. Drop them off. And do what can go left, I'll go right. Perfect. We should take a look at his upgrades. Hey, the shield recharge is pretty fast. That's nice. I'm not convinced by the elevator, to be honest. I think the elevator has, was, a, was a bad purchase. Oh, that's a mother load. Grab some of them. Oh, damn, I need to grab two. Maybe with upgrades, but... Elevator really seems pretty weak. We've got to get up. We've got to get up urgently. Oh, Nice. I love it when we can pull off that little kind of physics <laughs> physics pull on extra extra blocks. We need better um, <clears throat> better weaponry. We're up to eight. Oh, it's not really enough for anything. Overcharge. Use water to manually overcharge the shield. I don't understand. Is is water the blue thing? I thought the blue thing was cobalt. Manually overcharge the shield. So I think that means I have to go over to it and. Ah, no. Oh, Jesus. Okay, well, uh, that went really badly. I think the overcharge, the shield is going to, it may save us here, but we may just lose anyway. I don't know which does more damage, these these ground ones or the, the flying ones, so I'm not sure who to focus. At least that one even got two shots off. If this one gets two shots off, we might be dead. Oh, that was really close. Okay, well, we clearly need to spend upgrades on health. So, um, let's repair twice and get the melee damage resistance. Oh, this game's hard. 
Lift slowly bringing people up. Drill bit. Doing what he can. Did we leave more down the right? I think we did. I should make sure they're on the left for the next cycle, ideally. Damn, I don't think we're going to be able to be in time. How many have we got down here? Four. Nothing just beyond there. Good to know. Some of the health is flashing here. If I can put them above the lift, then that'll be good. Hey, some more, uh, more cobalt. At least I think it's cobalt. Taking drill but a really long time to dig through. He's asleep again? Drill but Come on, man. I need you to pull your weight. I'll dig back to him so we can start further out. Wake up. <laughs> I need you working. Maybe we can find another gadget. We should start going up. I'll take the water with me. Take a bunch of it with me. Maybe we can do a bit of a... Yeah, there we go. That's really satisfying. And then we should um, overcharge this thing. How do I overcharge it? Oh, I don't know. Oh, we've got 12. That's enough for an upgrade, actually. Oh, but I don't think we have time. We need to focus on getting these damn doggos away. These little ones. There's, they're, they're easy to kill, but they do a lot of damage. I think it was the right choice to focus them. And then we can get this guy here before he can shoot again. Maybe get him as well? Not quite. Hey, the shield held that time, though. That's really good. Now, upgrades. I think I am going to upgrade myself, even though I know I know, I wanted to get the uh, the weapon upgrade. We should also we should really look at the lift upgrades. Because I know I said I don't think I like it, but now that we've got it, we really ought to make the most of it. Can we go a little easier digging this direction? No. Drill, but you better not be asleep over there again. Nice, easy digging. And indeed, Jorba is still working away. That's good. Anything to find up there? Nothing yet. Oh, some cobalt. That's good. And there's the edge. Okay. Grab those. Throw them on the left. We can do a little bit more for the next wave. Let's probably go in the other direction. Although, I mean, I don't know. I think I want to grab these straight up to the left, yeah. I think it makes sense to go in the same direction Cobalt's going, because then it's not Cobalt, um, drill bit, because then you can keep an eye on him. Although, ideally, we want to just stay digging in the easy stuff. Although, I don't know, maybe the harder to dig through stuff has a higher chance of having good stuff in it. But, I don't know, we need to go back up. It's a matter of urgency. Bump that one a little bit. <clears throat> Ooh, I'm barely going to be in time. We've got a long way down now. Lots of stuff getting crunched up. Let's check out upgrades before we fight here. Um, <clears throat> okay, so we can get plus one orbs, an additional lifting orb, more speed. Boost your speed when moving upwards inside it. Ah, that's nice. Okay, then yeah, the drill strength on him. Treat growth time. Treats grow at the nest under the dome. Take them to drill, but to keep him gobbled up and energized. Drill, but sounds like it seems like a lot of maintenance. <laughs> I think electro burst will be good to help stun enemies when they're getting close to us. And then, um, orb speed. No, bring bring me up faster, and bring more stuff up. Ah, and then we got to get into the fighting, fighting mode. Okay, it's, I think I think stopping this guy, and we'll send out the Electro Blast. Ah, oh, it's not charged, though. Most of that we took on the shield, at least. But now we've got no shield to deal with this. Ah! It's so bad. Got him down. Man, the health is tanking. We have no repair gear. No, no red stuff to repair with. Okay, we'll see, though. With the... With the new orbs and the new orb, uh, like the bonus to flying upwards, we'll see. I feel like we're really struggling, though. One more orb doesn't seem like that many. Please be at a mother load. Please be like a bunch under it. Nice, there's one at least. Ah, uh, there we go. Okay, let's grab these onto the lift before we uh, do anything else. 
And yeah, grab the rest of this. We need some defense upgrades. The thing is, I mean, it's anytime you fall behind, I'm feeling like it's really tough to get ahead again because, you know, anytime we're not fighting, um, you know, we're not buying upgrades for mining because we have to buy upgrades for defense because we're on the verge of death. It puts us at a huge disadvantage, right? Because we, uh, you know, we aren't buying the upgrades that are helping us mine faster, which are the ones that will give us more gains in the future. Hello, Drover. I need you to wake up. And come over here. Now, if I drop you... I dropped the wrong thing. No, but we're not going to get in time for the wave. Everything's going wrong. All right. Drawbert, just drop him. We need to drop everything. Drop Drawbert right down to the bottom. Then hopefully he'll have a good go. These three coming in. All right, we have to take no damage this time. It's the only option. Oh, Jesus Christ. What the hell is that thing? Oh, no. Can I shoot it down? Oh, my God. It's all going horribly wrong. Kill it, kill it. Come on, die. Oh, got me again. Man, hard is hard. Oh, I don't want to keep one of these gadgets for the next run, to be honest with you. But I think the lift did more than drill, but... Wow. Well, this is a... This is a fun game. Thank you very much for watching. I'm going to call it a part there. The dome is lost, but yours might not be. If you want to try it out, again, the link will be in the description. Thanks very much to the devs for being nice enough to give me a code. And, uh, yeah, I'll, I may play it again in the future. We may try it on stream. I think it'll be fun on stream. But, uh, yeah, hope you enjoyed it. And check the game out.